If you have tuned in to KXAN at any time during the last three decades, then you've seen our co-worker and our friend Robert Hadlock sitting right here delivering the news. And today we are happy for Robert because he has decided to move on to the next chapter of his life. But candidly and selfishly, <laughs> we are sad because it is his last day here with us at KXAN. He's retiring after 32 years on the air here at our station. And what an incredible career. I had a chance to sit down with Robert to talk about his next steps as well as he plans for a well-deserved retirement. Do you have any plans for retirement? I don't really. I mean, we're, we're, uh, we'd love to travel, uh, my wife and I, and but we can't do all of that all the time. We're, we're going to uh, figure it out and, and see where we go from here. Do you have any uh, hidden talents? You know, former President Bush, he paints. <laughs> President Obama, he does the, the kite surfing. You're going to take a, some kite surfing out on the lake? Well, I have uh, tried golf in the past. I've kind of let it go for now, but it, it might be in the future uh, making a comeback. And, uh, as bad as I am at that, it's, it's still intriguing. I love watching golf on television. It's a weird feeling to be uh, stepping away, but I think the time has come, and I'm very happy for you uh, to get this position. All right, well, Robert Hadlock, on behalf of KXAN, on behalf of Austin, all of Central Texas, all of our viewers, thank you so much for everything you did over 32 years, your service to our community. I just... It's not going to be the same without you. So thank you, Daniel. I'm I'm very happy for you. I know what you're getting into, and it's a good thing. <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> <laughs> Believe me, it's a good thing, and you're going to see a lot and experience a lot. And I'm, I'm I'll be watching from home for sure. Really nicely done. I know that there's a lot of pressure when you <laughs> interview somebody like Robert who has years of experience and that's honestly what I'll miss the most about him. He's always talking about the news. He's invested uh -huh. in the news stories, what NBC, our network is airing, and he's always showing me clips and so I'm going to miss his history and his wisdom. But I have to say, in the same breath, we are so excited to have you, Daniel. Well, thank you. I know you're a Texan and you went to UT. I did, so yes. you're right here at home here in Austin with all the burnt orange fans. <laughs> you know, what are you most excited about as you return here to Austin and take this really important <laughs> seat here? Uh, hey, oh, yeah, what a heavy crown to lift, right? But yeah. uh, I'm excited for the city. It's an evolving city, it's changing. There's yeah. a bright future for the city. So I'm excited for that. I'm excited to work with you. I'm excited to work with David.